Hi guys! So I am back with a little haul. Well, maybe not so little. I did some damage the other day at the mall and figured I would share what I got with you guys because this is officially my very first clothing haul. So I'm not gonna make this video any longer than it has to be, so we're just gonna get right into it. So before we get into the clothing, I did pick up some makeup goodies and the first place I went to is of course Sephora. And I just picked up a few things because I think you all know what I wanted to try out. It is the very hyped up and widely talked about Cover FX custom cover drops. And I wanted to order these online, um, but they are literally sold out in mostly every single shade. And of course the two shades that I wanted, um, they were sold out of, so I had to go to the store and pick it up. I picked it up in G30 and G40. I haven't tested these out yet, I just got this like a day and a half ago, so I will be doing a review on this very soon, so keep an eye out for that. So I am very excited to try that out, and then I just got a tiny little bottle of the Bumble and Bumble Surf Spray because I love my Lush, what is it called, Sea Spray or Ocean? Ocean Salt Spray, Ocean Salt Sea Spray, Sea Salt Spray, something like that. I used it last summer and it put crazy volume in my curls and just made me like super voluminous and awesome. So I wanted to give this a try because this is obviously very famous from their brand. So I will try this out and then maybe do a comparison video for you guys if you want. But I'm really excited to try this out too. But that's all I got from Sephora. I try not to do too much damage in there because that's very easily done. So let's get into the clothing part of this video. I went into Uniqlo for a little bit and just got a pair of really bright um, like sorbet orange coral leggings. Yeah, they're leggings. They're not denim. They're really stretchy. And I might have to go back and exchange this size because I got it in an X small, which fits, the length fits perfectly, but perfectly, <laughs> perfectly, but um, the waist, not the waist, the hip part was too small because I am short but have childbearing hips and it's really annoying to, ugh, can't speak, it's really annoying to find pants that fit me perfectly. They're either too loose but the right length or too tight and too long. I mean, the problems are endless. So I love the color of these though. They're super pretty and perfect for summer. This with just um, nude sandals and a white t-shirt and then like gold accessories would just look really cute and simple but yet really chic and um, kind of put together without really trying because these are super comfortable. They're just not wide enough for my darn hips. So I will be returning these and getting the small size but they're really nice quality, really thick and they did have them in a black color and gray color, and I might get the gray ones because those would be perfect for the fall. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited for these, and these were $29.90. So that was from Uniqlo, and then the rest that's in this gigantic Steve Madden bag is from Forever 21. Some of it I have worn already because I just got super excited for them. And the first thing was these denim jeans. These are the premium denim line because Forever 21 does have a more affordable denim line and trust me, do not buy them. I know they're like $11 or $10, but they are crap. You wash them and they fall apart. They're not thick. They just look cheap on you. So spend like the extra $10, $15 and get their premium denim. It's really good quality. I would say that it rivals American Eagle jeans qualities, which I absolutely love because they last me years and years and years. I've had my American Eagle jeans for maybe eight years and they still last and fit and just awesome quality. And I feel like these are the same thing. So these are just a medium wash with a little bit of the, um, what is this scratchy pattern called? <laughs> like ripped denim kind of look, but they don't have any holes in them because I hate jeans that come with holes because I always put my foot through the darn hole and make a bigger hole. So these are just really nicely faded and just look really distressed but really, really natural and like California girl-esque. So this with a white t-shirt would just look super, super cute and I don't know, I love that kind of outfit, these distressed jeans and a t-shirt. It's just so sexy and so simple and so comfortable. 
So I got these and I believe these were about $32, which is a little expensive for Forever 21, but again, they're really good quality, so I don't mind. So I got those. And then I got these yoga pants, which I have worn because I'm just really excited for them. And they are Capri yoga pants, awesome quality. I think these were $20 or $25. And these are the ones, I wish they had the names on them. They have two side pockets for your phones or your credit card, chapstick, car keys, whatever you need at the gym. And then they have a little perforated this is going to be difficult, perforated section. I don't know if you guys can see that, just like this little diagonal slit right here. So they're kind of like sexy and shows a little bit of skin, I mean the tiniest bit, but really comfy. They're completely opaque. And then I got this peachy colored ribbed crop top and this was $5.90, so super affordable. And I just got this in a small, it's crop top and let's see. Yeah, it comes to like, my belly button is like here, but once you put like a bra on and then your boobs fill out the shirt, it lifts it up a little bit. Um, I think I got this in black too, but I love this peach color. This with white um, high-waisted shorts would just look super pretty and cute and just so girly and feminine. So I got this, and then I just picked up another pair of their leggings. I just wore these today. I got these in an X small, and I love their leggings. They're pretty sheer, so just size up, like one size up, so that um, you have more material to cover your butt cheeks, because once you put them on, they're a little sheer. But the X small fits perfect on me. Um, they're not too long, which for somebody that's 4'11", that is very important. And I think these were only like $3.90, so really good quality for such an amazing price. I got those in black. Um, I got that same peach ribbed crop top in black, and I love it in black because I think I have a picture of me wearing it on Instagram. I'll insert it here somewhere. Um, but yeah, really pretty, really simple crop top black shirt. I also picked up a couple sports bras by them because they looked really cute online and I'm really, really glad that I ordered them because the quality and material is really, really good for something that's only $7.90. This one is just a heather gray one that's kind of crisscrossed in the back and it has padding so your nipular area won't poke through and make a special guest appearance. I got this in a small, again it was only $7.90. And there's a little tag on here that says wicking, so I'm assuming it'll be great for sweat. So that's always awesome. This is just so simple and pretty, um, and the quality is really amazing. I'm really impressed by it. And then I got the yeah same one in a mint green. I mean, super pretty. This is going to look really cute with the black yoga pants that I showed you. Again, $7.90, and I got this in a small as well. I got this really pretty and feminine... Um, flouncy kind of daisy pattern black dress. It flares out a little bit at the bottom. God, I hope this haul isn't like dizzying and annoying because I'm just like, well, look at this. So this one is really pretty. They do have adjustable straps, which is, again, amazing for short girls. These were on sale for $12. I keep saying these. This was on sale for $12, and it's really good, um, soft, kind of like not chiffon but a really soft cotton material. So this is just going to look really cute with um, either wedged booties or just flip-flops and a denim jacket. I picked up another pair of yoga pants and these were $12.90 so I mean really really affordable prices for really really great quality um, material. I don't know how they will be washed and dried, but I assume that I'm just going to wash these and let them air dry because I don't want them to kind of bunch up or wrinkle or pill up or anything. But these are really cute. They're solid all the way down. And then towards your calves, you have this crisscrossy pattern, which is just such a pretty feminine, simple detail, but really makes the yoga pant really different and girly and fun because no one likes working out, but if you're gonna look cute doing it, it makes it a little bit better. So I got these, and these were in an X small, so I'm excited to wear these and get my workout on. And then I have 
um, what are you? Denim short. These are in light denim and these are $34.90, which is kind of expensive for denim shorts. I feel like they're the same price as my denim jeans. These I got in a small, they're supposed to be casual and just really cute over a bathing suit bottom and then like a bathing suit top with some flip flops. I got this in a small, I might have said that already. Again, this looks kind of big. I just hope they just look big and fit me. And we're getting down to the bag, guys, I promise. I got a pair of the leggings but in the Capri style, so I mean, kind of boring, but I just wanted one to wear around the house or to run out and run errands. These were $3.90 and I got these in the next small too. Um, these were the most questionable um, item that I got. This is the long woven black pant and they're kind of stretchy and then they taper down to this at the bottom, kind of like a jogger style pant, but they're like really silky, linen-y, soft, comfortable material. And the girl that was wearing it online just looked really cute with these black flip-flops and a white t-shirt and just looked so effortless and chic and she looked so comfortable. So I wanted to give this a try. This I got in an X mold, but it looks gigantor. So hopefully these will fit nicely on, but the material is so soft and cooling so this will be perfect for summer nights so that was all i got clothing wise the last item i got was from steve madden and this is probably the most exciting thing i got i have been eyeing and looking for these shoes forever and i feel like everyone and their mother has been wearing it and i couldn't find one that truly fit my foot and i'm talking about the um really simple strappy heel sandal they're not too high I think these are like four and a half inches high the heel um, there is no platform so it's a little bit uncomfortable to wear if you're not used to wearing a shoe without platform but I wear them all the time so I don't think I'll mind it it's just a single strap by your toes and then a strap by your ankles and these literally I feel like look good with looks good with everything with jeans rolled up, with a dress, with a skirt, with a t-shirt dress with these and some like bulky jewelry to kind of funk it up a little bit. I mean these just look so adorable with everything and everyone has been wearing it for the past like two seasons and I could not find them in my size. Um, I was going to splurge and get the Stuart um, Weissman ones but those are just so expensive. So these are a great alternative. I think these were only $89. Um, they're by Steve Madden. They have them in a ton of colors. And I think I'm going to be getting the nude one as well. Um, and I also want the really, um, I also really want the white pair, but the nude one is next on my list. They're just so simple and so pretty. And I'm really excited about these. Oh, I didn't even tell you what they were. These are the Stacy style sandal by Steve Madden. Um, not Stacy. It's like Stacy with an E, so like Stacy. And these do run a little small. I'm usually a five, universally in all shoe brands, but these I got in a five and a half. They do run a little narrow, so I would just try them on in the store first before ordering them. But I think they're free returns online, anyways. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited about these and I can't wait to wear them. So that was it for my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed my very first clothing haul. So if you guys want more clothing hauls or makeup hauls, I'm sure there will be a makeup haul coming up very soon for all the summer makeup that the brands are going to be putting out. So if you want more hauls, let me know down below. And again, thank you guys so much for watching and supporting and subscribing and always leaving me really, really sweet messages. And you guys are just awesome. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.